All right, so we're in Walmart and we're gonna see what the state of Walmart and Hart specifically is. $25.92 for the Hart tub. Let me spin this around. I mean, don't get me wrong. Those are nice looking tubs, but you know, good tub price is like 20 or 12 bucks or 14 bucks. This is, I'm not seeing 25 bucks on that. Now we got our main heart display here. We got batteries, oh my gosh, $150 for, is that two? Two four amp, 20 volt batteries for a hundred. I hope that's mismarked. I don't think it is. Basic combo for 178. Here's the thing was heart is regular price. Heart's not that great a deal, but they have some killer deals when they go on sale, especially when they go on clearance. Let's break over here. We got some rollback pricing. Let's see what's up here. Well, we'll start at the top, $64. Oh, heart brother, what are you doing? When they launched, it seemed like such a great deal. Like they were gonna really make something of this line. And it's a decent DIY line. It is. I mean, it's Ryobi in white with a better battery system. But, man, these prices. I just, I just, I'm not seeing it. $45 for a one-hour charger. <laughs> 64 bucks on the kit. Half-inch drill driver. Of course, it's not the brushless one. There's the impact driver. The, um, let's see here. We got the impact Hammer drill, $89 in the hammer drill. Now that's a full kit here. Oh, let's see here. Now there's the brushless. And the brushless just, it isn't that compact. Now, I guess for an impact, that's not bad. There's the circ saw, the grinder, brushless on the grinder. It's, you know, I $69 for the 3 8 $98 for the half inch. Let's see what else, 49 on the jigsaw. Hey, at least they got a jigsaw, Hercules. Oh, let's see what else we got here. It, it, it's hard to get excited about these. I mean, be, other than being able to go into a Walmart, I mean, that's nice to see the brush system up here, but uh, being able, if you're going to Walmart anyway, if that's what's in your area, there you go. Well, it's like a hyper tough, man. This 12 volt line, we got a, a multi-tool, one hand resip, we got, the short ratchet, the long ratchet, an, an impact, impact wrench, an impact driver. Not bad for a 12 volt system here. Look at this. Let's take a look at this one. Oh. <laughs> and everything's dead. Of course it is. But still, that's a fairly extensive line of 12 volt stuff there it's not gonna be the most powerful the stuff i've seen about it is kind of mediocre but for a diy around the house can't be really angry at that let's see what else we got we got some quartz sanders 26 dollars 22 dollars belt sander for 35 not bad for you know diy level kind of stuff pump we got the arrow we're looking for the, the air tools. All right, let's see what else we got here. Goodyear, coming in here on the, uh, the tax. They switched over to Goodyear a while back. Look at this air compressor, Hart air compressor. 200 PSI, coming at 278. 20 gallon for 200, that's gonna be oil-less, yeah, oil-free down there. Um, pancake here, six gallon pancake, coming at 150. Here's your hyper tough versus your Goodyear. I mean, don't get fooled by the Goodyear. That's just an OEM. Has nothing to do with the company, Goodyear. Air compressor down here. We've got uh, pressure washer. Nice pressure washer, very similar to the Ryobi. Of course, it's probably same DNA. 374 on that. Well, let's see what we got. Any good sales? We got some rollback. We got $98 on the hyper tough. That's not, it's not floating my boat, as it were. Anything else? Nope, let's come around over here in the other aisle. Try not to show, you know, all the customers and stuff. We try to be a little respectful when we're doing this. Man, they got a selection of 
a box cutters here, don't they? Actually, some of these are kind of nice, kind of interesting. Uh, I don't know if that's my thing, but it's different. That's not terrible. I think I like those. What else we got here? Nice little hook pick set there. Infrared thermometer's a little pricey. Uh, clamps, 344. Not too terrible. Here we go. This will take on the Eagle Grip any day of the week. Five inch locking pliers for 388. 388. That's not that's not too bad on that. Oh, here was here's a ratchet here, a little old school SK knockoff, three eighths. Nine dollars. Hey, there was a time I'm not knocking it. There was a time where that was my budget. Got tape measures. Let's see what else over here. We got more buckets. Heart shelf system. Nothing super exciting jumping out at me. Hypertop. Look at this breaker bar. Ten dollars. Ten dollars for a made in the U. Is that say made in the USA? That says made in the USA. With a strike plate on the end. I can't be ten. No, it's over here. Twenty-two dollars, but still twenty-two dollars for a made in the USA. That's why it's hanging there because that, that hook's about to break. It can't hold these things. That is. I don't know. I'd, if I need one, I got the Mayhew, but I'd be willing to take a shot on that. All right. Let's see what else we got here. Here's some more locking pliers. We got Rollback Hyper Tough. Nice little. Look at this nice little adjustable wrench. Almost like an EDC kind of wrench. That's kind of cool. Kind of like that. Uh, any other deals? We got some socket deals. Rollbacks on the sockets. We got SAEs. Metrics, deep sockets. Let's see what else. And then when I saw, we got some of the Hyper Tough. Standard price. 119 on that with the little mini, you know mini hutch in the center home garage kind of stuff that's not a bad price actually it might be 150 probably not that one probably probably wrong price on that probably the 150. all right anything else exciting over here well that's kind of it well there you go that's what's going on at walmart right now it's definitely better than what it used to be. And luckily my Walmart, everything isn't locked up like a lot of them are. Anyway, let me know what you think down in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe. You all take care and God bless. And as always, shine on.